Welcome back, fellow Gaians. I am the Neural, and this is Building Gaia. Today, we are going to be working on stuff and more stuff. Yeah, we have a pretty, pretty, hmm, uh, pretty big build ahead of us, uh, and it involves smooth stone. Go figure. Now, last we left off. We finished this little thing, and I I still haven't brought that down. Mm, eh, but now I wanted to to say, and I'm I'm actually gonna post this on Twitter, uh, that inspiration can come from anywhere, and I mean anywhere. Uh, and I I am going to post a picture of where I got the inspiration for what I am about to do. One, two, uh, let's just, one, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Uh, for what I, I am about to do, which is pretty, mm, it's a thing. And I think I, I finally found my, uh, my style. Uh, I think I, I have fi finally found it. That's neat. Uh, I am going to try and make a and go f with um, a sort of mm, alienish style. My alien my, might be uh, might be the the best wording for it. So let's just go up one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven with this one. So that was one. This is two. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and eleven. Okay, now we can eh, we can get to work. Uh, now I have been been uh, really busy with the unnamed server, and not only that, whoops, not only that, I have also been uh, uh, fairly busy in real life. Uh, th there's been so a lot of stuff go going on. Um, the I I I wasn't really expecting things to get so so hectic, uh, but I I do have a, a lot of stuff to take care of. Uh, what with my uh, my deceased grandmother's house. And uh, not only that, but uh, social security and, and uh, financial stuff. So that's all uh, kind of in the way. Uh, but in other news, I have just heard that Vladimir Putin has been nominated for a Nobel Peace Prize. And that, my friends, I think speaks for itself. <laughs> Oh dear lord. <laughs> I mean come on Putin. <laughs> uh, oh I I just had to to share this moment uh, of uh, true uh, true happiness w with you guys. <laughs> it, it's so oh oh oh. Okay. So what are we g doing here? I want to have a couple of these structures so one here, one there, and possibly two uh, on the inside. I st I'm still not sure because uh, ideally this would, would involve lava, uh, but it's so close to that and all fire spreads in such a, a strange way that I am really unsure. But right now, uh, we are going to go up w with this just one more, uh, better yet, a lot more but we are going to go up let's see if i can uh, see this one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen seventeen eighteen nineteen twenty twenty one so one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen seventeen eighteen nineteen twenty twenty one and this is one of those times where uh, where following the the golden ratio uh, really helped me design this 
Uh, like I said, I, I am going to post a picture on Twitter uh, showing you where I got the inspiration for, for this. Uh, and uh, it's really... Uh, I don't know, man. I, I just looked at that thing and said, I could build that, make that little thing uh, like uh, 70 meters high and... Uh, it would look like a really, it could look like a really alienish thing. Uh, so that abstract alien, I'm not sure if it's industrial or not look, uh, but it, uh, I, I'm hoping the, that I can get a better grasp uh, of uh, the aesthetics I, I'm looking for, uh, so that I don't lack as much as inspiration uh, as I uh, I recently have. Now, hopefully, this won't block the view of that too much. But in any case, if we we see that it does, we will probably uh, I might add a couple more entrances, not like the, uh, this one, but <clears throat> smaller side entrances. So, so that we, we can, when we start expanding or something, although we'll probably, uh, excuse me, we'll probably return to, to the core if we, or when we go so, somewhere uh, farther away, we'll probably return to the core via um, a nether portal. Uh, but still, maybe a couple more entrances... Oh dear, I am screwing up. <laughs> Maybe a couple more entrances uh, are uh, will be required. Hmm, I have just screwed up this, so I am going to have to recount blocks. Uh, tell you what, I am going to get the basic shape for this laid out, uh, or at least the, the first part of it, and I'll be right back with you. Boy, we are really high up. <laughs> Yeah, so this is how far we've gotten. So just above there. And then we can use this thing to... I know, I know you can't really understand what's going on. And I'm doing it on purpose. Uh, then we can uh, start a, a little arch for, uh, above this thing. Uh, use this as, uh, to frame the arch in. So what do you say we take a gander at what this thing actually looks like from down below uh, which is something that I have no idea because I haven't gotten down yet okay let's try not to kill ourselves here mm. okay yeah I brought these with me and there seems to be some sort of a, mm -hmm, maybe a bug a glitch I, I'm not really sure uh, because this texture isn't in my resource packs. This gravel texture, <laughs> I don't have it anywhere. Anywhere. I really don't understand. I have deleted all the... I don't even have a resource pack that um, that features this, this texture for, for gravel. Uh, so that is really strange. I have no idea what's going on. Oh, and by the way, I forgot to mention, there is a official story of Mojang uh, video out there. Uh, it is a documentary uh, about, about Mojang and Minecraft. And that is very cool. It's very, it's very well written, well produced it's really professional and it, it follows uh, no uh, it follows mojang uh, across 2011 and 12 i think uh, it's really interesting i, I just uh, I, i'll i'll link if i remember i'll link the the video in the description but if, uh, if not, just Google Story of Mojang Official. <clears throat> I'm sure I it'll come up high in the search results. It's really, really good. It's very inspiring, really beautiful. And let's see what this thing looks 
looks like. Uh, this does not look like anything at all. Exactly what I wanted. <coughs> See, these bits I want to fill with water. Although, now that I think about it, it's probably not going to be that noticeable. But, eh, okay. So, it, it would probably be safe to fill it with lava, but... But I'm eh, this is what one, two, three, four, five blocks away from the trees, but I'm not sure. Uh, I have to build a footing for this, maybe. I don't know. What do you think? Should I prolong this to the ocean floor? Hmm, maybe it would ruin the effect. Um, anyway, it is still not done. Uh, there's one bit missing uh, but what I'm thinking of, of is building is that oh yeah uh, building four things like like this one two and then on the inside three four the ones outside with water and the ones on the inside with lava uh, if if I'm confident oh, excuse me that it won't burn this down which I hope it doesn't, but if it does, I'll just kill myself and that won't be a big issue. <laughs> uh, so yeah, I, I am going to prolong the foot of this thing. Um, hmm, maybe maybe even widen it a bit. Mm, maybe. Oops. Crap. Maybe. I, I'm not sure. But I'm going to do it anyway. I, I, I'm going to do whatever, whatever comes to mind <laughs> uh, and uh, and I'll come back to you when I have the, the next little thingy doodle doodler uh, up and running. Be right back. Okay, everyone, I added the final thingy to thingamajize the thingy and uh, I forgot to bring one a ah, smooth stone block. Uh, but now it is time to figure out how we are going to go about this. And I believe the best solution is to go like this and then possibly put lighting in these inter intermediate things. Although, imagine if, you, if we put lighting here on these, there won't be any lighting at all here when, when it gets down lower so I'm not too sure wait uh -huh. however we can get but we can get this figured out pronto oh god I, my memory is just awful I was just thinking about something that I I wanted to tell you guys and uh, now it, it completely eludes me Mm, this mm, eh. I'm gonna have to slabomize the this part very probably mm, okay uh, what do you say we hop on down and see and take a look at the finished result here we point come on okay uh it's a shame that the um, uh the brick stairs uh, don't really don't mix with the do uh, don't mix with the um, the smooth stone as well in this texture pack as in default uh, but uh, like like I like I say a lot of times uh, I uh, I use this texture pack, but I want it to be default friendly, so it, it may actually even look better in the default texture pack the, than in this one. But in any case, let us take a gander. Oh, goody, goody, goody. You can't really see the water, can you? Unless you're, like, here. Hmm, it's very visible during the day. I wonder how it is at night, because I really I, I didn't want to use up a lot of glowstone for this. I might cram 
a couple in there maybe I don't know we'll have to see how this looks like at night but all in all I I think I like it let's just see if it doesn't cover up the the dragons too much and these things have got to go not at all not at all yeah 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 imagine two of these just yeah now hmm yeah i'm looking at this and trying to trying to figure out am i am i saying that i like this uh this sheer <laughs> i still i'm still worried about that uh Am I leaving this just raw smooth stone b because I, I'm lazy or incapable of decorating it any better? Or do I genuinely like the this uh, nakedness, the, this sheer stone wall aspect? Uh, that's one thing. Tell you what, I I'll let you guys decide what you think about it. But yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I'm paranoid. I'm paranoid like that. And ah, I thought I had seen a mistake there. So now it's only a matter of building three more of these. <laughs> uh, uh. Now it, it's not really that hard. I screw uh, screwed up a couple of times counting blocks, but uh, I don't. I, I think I didn't actually finish the reasoning th uh, a while back when I said that the golden ratio is uh, what I used to to define where these slits were. Uh, this is a golden ratio ex exercise, so you have one there, two there. The uh, a Fibonacci sequence. This is also a Fibonacci sequence. Uh, which uh, translates to a golden ratio so there should be one more there but that's okay it starts with 1 2 3 5 8 13 21 then uh, 13 plus uh, 21 plus 13 is 41 40 well is 34 and then this plus 21 34 plus 21 is 55 34 44 54 55 yeah uh, and you get this so i think uh, i'm going i think i'm going on a, b a little building binge here and just finish up the the other three because this really requires a lot of concentration and uh it's really pleasant for me to build it while i'm in the zone uh, so i guess i will see you guys i'll probably make a status update or, or two maybe even uh, finish the episode before we finish all this but in any case i'll be building and you will be watching yay okay everybody this building bi binge here has just come to a close uh, and we're not go gonna do i'm not go going to build the other two this episode just yet because i realized we are already w way ahead in time so we have to wrap this up and i'll show you how how this looks with both uh, both sides built uh, in the next episode yeah in the meantime in the meantime i am screwing up hmm. <coughs> excuse me i have to go back down <laughs> Okay. Uh, in the meantime, oops, no, 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 no. Uh, uh, you can go. Okay. Okay. One, two, three, four. That's that's buckets enough. And in the meantime, <coughs> I wanted to share with you a story. There go my frame rates again. Uh, I wanted to show with uh, to share with you a, a story uh, uh, about a nightmare I had, and this was already uh, like uh, hmm, four weeks ago, maybe, maybe even more. Uh, and I hadn't told you yet. I don't really know why, <laughs> uh, but essentially, uh, we have we may have mobs up there. Uh, but essentially, I had. Uh, gotten a comment 
and uh, this was really uh, wow the, this really put me down I dreamt uh, that I had a comment uh, uh, my first negative comment but it wasn't one of those um, it wasn't a stupid or obnoxious negative comment it was uh, a well thought and uh, well supported uh, constructive uh, critic that uh, that just happened to be negative. Uh, someone commented on one of my videos that, uh, "Hey, uh, it seems like you you're doing you're doing your best and." Uh, clearly you enjoy this and whatnot, but uh, seriously, I I don't think th this is uh, this is the thing for you. And it went on with uh, uh, it went on explaining why they thought th this wasn't for for me and said, uh, "Man, your your videos, uh, uh, the sound quality is horrible. You." Uh, you um and mm all the time. You, d there's not enough stuff going on. D well, all the basically it was me criticizing myself. <laughs> that was my, that was my my own brain talking. Uh, <laughs> but but and I'm usually my my biggest critic, my own biggest critic. Uh, but this was just so. Uh, well, I, I have never gotten a, a negative comment. Uh, there was uh, one uh, one person who commented. I don't know if you're watching this. Who who didn't like the idea of texture packs? Uh, but well, th that was well. I it wasn't positive, but but it. I can't really qualify it uh, as a a, a negative thing. Let's see. Can we make this? Oh God! No! 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 Oh! 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 Okay. Wow. <laughs> uh, let's see if we can hop on back there. Uh, it, it wasn't positive, but it, it wasn't horrible either. Uh, it's an, an opinion. Uh, but anyway, th this. Wow, this is gonna take a long, long time. Let's see if we can't. I'm an idiot. Here, teleport back to me. All right, let's try this again. But that was essentially uh, the a, a really horrible nightmare, <laughs> to say the least. <laughs> Uh, it, it, it was like everything that I think might be wrong with with this series uh, was given to uh, to me. It was transmitted to me by someone else, uh, which meant that they were absolutely right. Uh, <laughs> that really made me. Uh, I actually thought uh, thought uh, thought quite a bit about it and asked myself to. Uh, Am I really? I enjoyed making the, these videos very much so, um, and uh, I, I do think that I am doing. I'm building stuff that I wouldn't be building if I if I hadn't uh, started the the series. So this is very motivating to me. Uh, but I still, uh, still I. I thought about about man. Uh, am I really entertaining people? Uh, am I just uh, uh, am I just a stain, or a little stain on on YouTube? Is this really worth it? But uh, well, in, in the end, I, I ended up I ended up convincing myself that eh, good job, bad job. I am doing something, and uh, I, I am having fun. And some people at least uh, appear to be having fun too. So let's just leave it at that. And as long as I have fun and this is, and I think this is cool, I'll I'll keep doing it. <laughs> okay. But now let's see 
how these things look. Let's just get rid of this bad boy right here. And it's time to see how these things look. And I, I do want to see how they look at night. But I think the, that the trees g give it a, a, very, a very good uh, grand reveal effect. Let's just get some, some noms here. Give it a, a very good grand reveal effect. It's, uh, I think it doubles the, the majesty and power of this, of this build. So let's just see how this looks to wrap up this episode and bam. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Yeah. Hmm. This is starting to, to be more and more screenshot worthy. I heard something splashing in the water. I am still hearing something splashing in the water. I'm kind of scared. And I will be in my house. Let's just kablamo. All right, everybody. For what it's worth, I have been the Neural, and I hope you have an awesome, awesome day.